Hey guys, what is going on today? I got a video for you about the defensive building called the Spider Gun, and it's very powerful and it's also very expensive and hard to get. So let's look at it in the market. It's under defense all the way in the back. It's probably the best unit in the best defensive structure in the game because of how powerful it is. And it's 4 million gold, you have to max out your command center to get it, which that's mainly why they added it. So not many people would have it because it's so overpowered. And it launches burning or freezing basically bombs in different directions. So it's basically shooting ba basically a wall breaker, and that's basically what it does. I know I said basically like 30 times, but that's pretty much what it does. And now... I have a video, I don't have it in my base because I'm not going to do that yet. So I attack this guy, and I'm just going to watch it again, so I can show you how overpowered it is. See, it's right here, and I'm, that's probably a level 1, and as you can see, in a couple seconds, it shoots uh, burning rounds. It's basically a bomb, and it goes in certain directions, and you have to, they have, units have to be in a radius of that bomb for it to do damage. So... Basically, I mainly try to get the bombs to attack me, so I put troops everywhere. I, I start putting troops here, and I put troops here, and I just mainly want to show you how much damage the bombs do. And I'm, it's going to take a little bit, because there's so many units around the base, like heroes and stuff, that I, and, and clan troops, that I couldn't get decent attacks from the bombs. So basically, that's pretty much what it is. I start placing placing troops down here because I see these bombs going down here. But this really doesn't do much up here. And I'm not really making any connections. So here you go. Here's a couple of soldiers right here. And this comes in and takes them all out from right there. That's pretty good range. And it does so much damage. And in my opinion, it is very overpowered. And that's basically it for this video. Well, for this uh, attack. Because not many of these troops get hit none of them actually they just stand around and shoot until the gunners come and my main advice for someone going up against that is don't attack it if you don't have to if there's like so much oil and gold that you want to attack it you can but if it's just like you're trying to attack him and your troops aren't that strong don't try it because it's so overpowered it does plenty of damage and in my opinion it's not worth it and that's pretty much it. I hope you liked the video. If you have a comment for another video, please post it below. I'll read it as always, and it might help a lot. So thanks for watching. Have a nice day.